Here's your Storm Track 7 forecast. I'm Storm Track 7 meteorologist Joy Bettenhausen. We're ending the weekend with some warmer weather continuing. However, we're going to add some more cloud cover into the mix. Partly cloudy skies and windy conditions are expected for today. Tomorrow, we'll introduce a chance of rain back into the forecast. This is mainly for later on Monday night, but it's still going to be windy. And then by Tuesday, Tuesday looks to be a washout day and kind of a raw day with a little bit of colder temperatures, those windy conditions, and of course, the rain. Today, winds will be out the south, gusting up to about 35 miles per hour or more at times. This will be especially prevalent in the afternoon hours. You could see winds gusting up to about 20 miles per hour. It will still be possible throughout tonight and through the overnight hours as well. Partly cloudy skies will be with us for most of the day today. Could see a little bit of peaks of sunshine here or there throughout the afternoon as some clearing does develop. But later on tonight, we'll start to see more cloud cover push in. Of course, this is ahead of our next chance in that system that will bring us rain. Mostly cloudy skies are expected overnight tonight through Monday. Today's high temperatures will be in the low to mid 70s. Again, it's going to feel nice out there, but we will deal with those gusty winds and those partly cloudy skies. Overnight tonight, it's actually going to feel pretty mild. Our low temperatures will only be in the upper 50s to low 60s with those clouds increasing and the winds will die off just a tad overnight. City by city forecast shows Waterloo, Dubuque, Cedar Rapids and Iowa City in the 70s today. Most of us in the 70s tomorrow and again that rain really won't push in tomorrow until about the evening into the overnight hours. Tuesday it's going to rain all day so just plan on that. Now with the colder temperatures surging in behind the system as it does move on out of eastern Iowa, we could see some of this rain maybe change over to a light rain snow mix or light snow. Not expecting any accumulations though, but don't be surprised if you see a couple flurries or two. That completely, it moves out of the way. It will be dry for Wednesday for Veterans Day, but it's going to be a lot colder. Temperatures only in the mid 40s. We'll stay dry through the rest of the work week. A couple more chances of rain this upcoming weekend with temperatures remaining in the 40s and we dry out for